This is the unboxing of the Bauer Digital Filter Kit. It comes with UV, fluorescent, and a polarizing filter, and it comes with a case. Let's take a look at that and see what each of these different filters does. Another nice plastic here. So these are the 52 millimeter size, which fits uh, most standard cameras. Uh, the UV basically just blocks ultraviolet light, and it's not a bad idea to have this on uh, just as a protection against dropping the lens and cracking the outer lens. So whatever is the most outside lens usually cracks first. So this is a good one to have at all times. Now you can usually screw these on right over if they have the uh, threads on the inside, which they do. So you can take the polarizing filter if you decide you want to use that and put that right over the UV filter when you screw down to the camera lens. So the polarizer, what that does is it separates out the light. So if you want to take a picture of the sky, for instance, it's going to separate the clouds from the sky so you, you can see them more defined. If you take a picture of grass, for instance, the grass will be greener, the sky will be bluer, that kind of thing. So it's, it increases the contrast, but you will sacrifice a little bit of detail in order to get that additional contrast. And the last one is the fluorescent one. So if you're taking pictures under fluorescent light, then they typically turn green. So this particular filter will filter that out. Although many new cameras will automatically filter most of that out, this will take it all the way out. So it's a good idea to use this instead of just relying on the camera to filter out the fluorescent green. And that's just basically because of the color of light. Our eyes automatically adjust to it, but uh, cameras, of course, cannot. So to us, we don't see that light as green, at least most of us don't, uh, but the camera would. So it comes with this nice uh, carrying case, little dividers in there, and that is the uh, Bauer Digital Filter Kit.